So what we're going to do here with this is just take it back to the arrangement part. Just show you a little bit. Here we go. Everything's in view. Ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. It appears that way. So we've already set this up. We're on a loop marker. So let's say this is the intro right here. And so it's like what do we want to be playing on the intro? So let's see, listen and take stuff out with the mute tool. Okay. Let's play. We already know we don't want the drums. Or the sub. Or the plucks. Or. And it's whatever you want to do. Okay, now let's start from scratch. Right, let's see. I know we want some, maybe Vox. Maybe pads, because that's got like a bounce. Yeah. That's good little intro. And come in with some little hi-hats maybe. Little clothes hi-hat. But on the second half of that. So you split it and then mute the first half. Hey, you got gangster didn't and take and take this first one and lower it. So when it come in it'll give you more of an impact. Let's try it again. See, I want this piece right here, this piece right here. I don't want all of it in there. Just maybe the beginning. Just the beginning. Do 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 do. Yeah. See, see, just just a piece of it. Yeah, and then everything can explode in. See, 
Right, like that. And this is arranging this type of vibe of music. And then when you're mixing it, <clears throat> you'll be panning certain things, bringing certain volume, up levels up or levels down and um, adding certain effects dropping stuff out of the way of the rapper or the singer and that's how you do it and different people do it their way or might feel a different vibe and do it how they want to do it you know so that's what's up yay Y'all can hear them rappers on it. I know you can. Hey, hey, hey. You know, you know how they do. And what I can do right now with some secret sauce, I can actually put a rapper on here like right now and have the rapper rap and listen to the mix with the rapper rapping and their cadence and stuff like that. And this way, it's called an acapella you can add on. And this way, you can vibe to how they rap. And, and it also inspires you to create um, more within your song and, and, and put drops and rises in certain places to fit the flow of the rap vocal. Because the rap vocal is also an instrument. So when I'm having a rapper in here or a singer, I'm using that vocal as an instrument as well when I'm thinking about mixing, arranging, and producing the beat. You know, so it, it, it's a give and take. And you got to always remember who's the star of the show. It's the performer. The music is to be their platform to let them do their thing. So you don't want to be overwhelming with the music unless that's an artistic taste that you decide on you want to do for this particular song or whatever. So that's how it is. I can further arrange this, which you basically I could just tell you. You drop certain things out, elements out, so you can hear the rapper rap. Uh, sing a sing, and then you bring it back. You have rises, you have drops. You change drum patterns. You remove some of the instruments. Uh, you add some in, and s some little ear candy here and there. And you got a beat uh, for a rapper or a singer. So, yeah, this is Sui Sauce at Sui Sauce Presents. And I'm back, y'all, with a vengeance. I'm going to do this daggone thing. And a special shout out to MG The Future. I'm so glad he back on this grind, doing what he doing as far as the music is concerned. Um, he doing his other stuff, and I'm proud of him. You know, he's a young cat um, doing his thing, and uh, his place is to do what he do when it comes to this music. So um, without further ado, i just like to say holla back, and Sui is in the building. Sui Sauce is back as well. All right, a shout out to everybody that know who they are. All right, like I always say, be woke, not wokeish. All the back, y'all. Peace. <laughs>